Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Laura with Stitching with Laura. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's having a great day. Well, today we have another unbagging. So let's see who it is from and who we need to do a review for. I love these bags. Well, looks like we got diamond painting and we got cross stitch. Okay, move my coffee. Let's not have any issues. So, this comes from the GBFKE store. And I guess we'll start with the diamond painting stuff and go from there. So, I got a diamond painting pen. Let's see, rip that off. Well, maybe not. Okay. Probably didn't even need to do that part. Yep because it has a little thing. I should have left it on there so I could pull it open. And this comes with ends. So we can always use more ends. And the diamond painting pin was 282 and it is a deer. Isn't that cool? Let's pull this. So this opens up his head comes off and you set it aside and you can put your little wide ends in there so it comes with oh it looks like a nine placer and a three placer a single placer a straightener those are always nice to have a bent single end Every time I use those, the, well, this one's a little tougher. The other one was that I got of a bent end um, was so thin it just cracked. So I'm just going to put it this way just a little bit. We don't need that anymore. And then we have like a six placer here with the nice rounded edges. So that's cool. And then let's put his head back on. It snaps back on. And the end, well okay maybe okay take that off hmm well hold that thought just two seconds I have to get something that I can grab a hold of it with well I guess that end does not come off actually so you put your single placer in and you can just diamond paint which isn't too convenient it holds nice in your hands though it's nice and slick you know because every time you want to use a multi placer then you got to take this out and put in a multi placer end so I might use it like as a spare I don't think that comes off I don't know but I thought maybe I could grab it with the towel, but nope, it's not moving at all. It's all one piece. I don't even see any lip there. So, yeah. Well, that's a little inconvenient. Well, it can just be a stocking stuffer. You can just stick right out of a stocking. How's that? Now, they should, by all means, send you a plastic bag to hold all your stuff, because you probably don't want to put it all back in here. But for the sake of not losing them, we're going to do just that. So that wasn't too expensive. And I don't know if they have this in silver. I just saw it in gold, so I got it. But yeah, it's a nice little present for somebody. And they can have all the ends to go with it. So that's different. Get our trash out of the way. Let's look at this diamond painting. It's a 30 by 45. So it's not very big. I've been buying some small ones, you know, just to work on in the middle of winter and, you know, everything and all. Ugh. Oh, come on. I know you have to get stuck. There we go. Let's put that up there. I actually got another diamond painting right back in that bag. So this is a Christmas one. And I know you've seen this image before. Hang on, we're about to lose everything. It's kind of long and skinny. Let me roll it backwards. Hang on. 
So we're going to have a, a nice collection of Christmas diamond paintings and cross stitches to work on next year as well. I'm not going to pull up the plastic, but there's a little girl here and she's making a snowman and she's got herself a basket of some kind of Christmas greenery that she was adding to his hat and his scarf. And there's a house here. So I just thought it was a cute image. I really did. Comes with a boat, wax, pen, and little baggies. Sometimes I use those, sometimes I don't. And these are all in individual bags. Hate that part. Hate it. Yeah, so. And I'm going to have to buy some more containers if I expect to start any more diamond paintings because at this point we're out. We'll see. All right, so it is 45 that way, right on the money, and 30 that way. The actual picture is 20, eh, 23 and a half, a little over, or 9 and a quarter, and by approximately 39. Uh, centimeters or almost 15 so it would fit an 11 by 14 frame you could cut a little bit off the top and a little off the bottom and then put some stuff around the sides so yeah I thought it'd make a beautiful picture see if I get these all done then I can just hang them up at Christmas see how that goes but yeah and this was four dollars and 89 cents it has very nice printing very easy to see. 24 colors. And I'll hold it up so you can see all the, the stuff. Isn't that cute? I just thought it was precious. It looks just like my granddaughter out there building herself a snowman. So, all right. Let's go to the cross stitch. Oh, I'm not going to take these out of the bag, but you can see there is a lot of white and blue and you got some red it has 321 red uh, 666 that 666 red um, no 923 no 38 or 3371 or 3771 whichever one it is but it does have 3865 and 3864 and you got purples and reds for the berries and greens so yeah it'll be beautiful don't know that I'll start that this year or not but we'll see we will see let me put that over there so it doesn't go you know that's the way things go all right so these are kind of the same size we'll start with this one it is a I just read it. 30 by 45. Pull that all out. Lay the plastic over there. As you can see, it's another one of my Peking girls. I don't think she's a Peking girl, though. But she's got dragons on her shirt. This is a very lovely image. Just absolutely beautiful. Just beautiful. Does have the product number, how big it is, and how many squares per square. So it's not very big. Has a fairly good size, um, what do you call it? <sighs> Key pattern, you know, paper pattern. If you'd like, you can blow it up. It does have instructions on how to start, how to finish. This has 43 colors, guys. 43 colors. Yeah, just happened to see her and went, yeah, she matches everybody else. So this has some 310, 939, 823s, uh, um, no, 3371 or 3771, whatever that number is. And, or, and it does have 3865 for the white. So, yeah. Interested to see how well this goes, but 43 colors. Nice, fair size pattern, you know, for these kits. So that's, ooh, that's a good thing. Let's take a look at the colors. Does come with a little kit with mm, 
five needles, poof ball, thimble, and a needle threader. And this one has a little deer on it. I don't know that you can see that, but I'll hold it still. Yeah, they're getting all different kinds of packs in this. And as you can see, there's not a whole lot of thread because it's not that big, which is a yay for me. Let's take a look here. Hang on, I gotta get it all unwound. All right, hang in there. So you got some mauve and a dark coral and a dark teal. This is a dark green. And there's your three eight six five. You got blues and pinks and shades of pink. And you got grays. Kind of a, a light lavender there. You have, probably it's 154. It's that dark, dark uh, plum color. Yeah, just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful colors. And your 823, 939 is over here. Just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let me shake it down. There's no extra... Um, skeins or anything let's take a look at the kit so see she's not very big she's actually smaller <coughs> than the Peking ladies that I've done before 43 colors night it is surged all the way around nice a dark key and the thread barely grazes where the numbers are so it doesn't interfere with that nice big uh, symbols that you can see very well printed but isn't that beautiful just gorgeous 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 just beautiful 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 Let's see measure it here for a minute like I said, it's not very big. So it is... Ah, if I can get a hold of it. Um, about 17. Pretty close to 17 inches or 43 centimeters. And this way it is 30 centimeters. Actual picture size is... 23 centimeters or 9 and a quarter by 14 and a half maybe a little bit more and it's 37 centimeters that way so yeah nice size very nice size I like that so I'm going to put her with my collection of of Peking girls I I, I don't know what they are they're, they're just nice images I like them then I had to get this one yeah it's beautiful Oh, and the, the girl was 10.72, and this one was 13.65. It's a little bit bigger. Well, if I could just figure out how to get in the bag, we'd have it made. There we go. Let's see if I can pull it all out in one fell swoop. I love this. Let me turn it right side up. Isn't that beautiful? With those, the male and female peacock. You got some bamboo, and then you got some, I don't know what those are, white blossoms. They're just beautiful. Look at all those beautiful colors in there. This is 40 by 60. Let's pull out the paper pattern has 30 colors this would definitely have it's very well printed but it, it's going to have to be uh, blown up it does have the product number how big it is and how many squares per square nice big key with the colors running down the side just beautiful 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 and 
none of the familiar colors. You do have some 550 purple, 823, 939, uh, you have 3370, but, and no 3865. So, yeah, that 25 is 3042, and it's kind of a, I can't tell if it's tan or purple, but yeah, very well printed. I can see everything. It's just, I wouldn't want to look at this for a long period of time. So, and I usually don't use them. There are two needles right there. There's that color. Whatever that color is. Taupe? I don't know. Whoa. I'm just guessing. Hang in there, guys. We're going to get this without knocking the camera completely off. So there's your colors. There's some gray. So there'll be a lot of gray in it. And lots of shades of blues. There's two there. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten different shades of blue in this. But yeah, it's just absolutely beautiful. And there's that, I don't know, I guess it's more of a pale purple. Pale to medium purple. I don't know. You'll, you'll have to be the judge of that. But it is gorgeous looking. I don't know. Yeah. Then you have some cream color. So there is no said white in this. There's another string of... of uh, teal yeah just beautiful 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 colors I'll just lay them right there so you can take a gander at them aren't they beautiful let me roll that up and put it up and then we'll take a look at the canvas oh my it, well, it's upside down hang on We'll start at the top. It does have the product number, how big it is, and how many squares per square. There's a nice, beautiful picture of the actual cross stitch right there. Uh, not of the cross stitch, but of the picture. So it's bigger than most. It does have the colors running down the side. It is not surged. But it's a nice, big, huge key. Very big. Now this has lots of big areas and, you know, like, all of one color not so much confetti now down in here maybe a little bit and down with the flowers it'll be confetti but very well printed very easy to read I love these 11 counts for us people that that have old eyes much easier to read for me than than a 14 count you know the funny thing is I will cross stitch with counted cross stitch on 14 count but when it comes to these it's very hard to see the symbols for me so when I'm just looking at the the other we're good let's turn it sideways lots of beautiful beautiful colors I'll hold that up so you can see all the symbols and then we'll measure it that is fine oh I know I put things away and then I can't find them and they're right where they're supposed to be isn't that the way that goes? You actually put it away where it was supposed to go. Amazing. All right, 59 or 23 and a quarter by 40 and a half or 16 inches. The actual picture size is 30 centimeters or 11 and three quarters by. 49 or 19 and a quarter so it's kind of a long and skinny picture but it would be beautiful lots of nice wide wide more margins here they're all about the same size all the way around which is nice and it doesn't bother me that it isn't surged it, it doesn't bother me at all this is kind of a thicker canvas talked about thick and thin canvases but it's nice and soft it's not all scratchy now you could go and put some either fold it down and run a serger across it or run a serger around the edge if you have such a thing I don't have a serger I don't even have a sewing machine anymore but yeah nice lovely 
beautiful. And I think all the colors are going to be gorgeous. I just think it's beautiful. Where to start? Anywhere but the background, right? So I guess I'd start with the peacock and work my way down. But just, just beautiful. I've been looking for peacocks and dragons and I look for geishas and ancient beauties and so I have a lot in my collection, you know, list of collections, I should say. We don't have a lot of those things, but whenever I see them, that's what I get. Now, GBFKE has uh, cross-stitch and diamond paintings. They do custom. They do embroidery. Uh, they do not have a separate Joy Sunday section. And... There aren't any extra cross-stitch crafts. Now, they may be having um, a lot of sales and things going on during Christmas. So, you can get some good deals even on things that aren't Christmas related. You know what I mean? They they have sales all the time. And I love it. They don't... They do have uh, free shipping over 55. Now, that says 55 euros. So, that's probably about $60, I'm guessing. I'm not real sure. I could look it up, but the phone is taking the picture, so that's not happening. But you get the point. You can Google it. So I, th I would say it's close to $60. And sometimes they have buy ones, get one, you know, that kind of thing. So do check that out and check out their specials. I don't know how long, if they have a Black Friday thing going or not, but I will put all that information down below. Thank you, GBFKE, for sending me these beautiful kits. And also, I ordered this on the 3rd of November, and I got it on Saturday the 26th. So it is taking about two weeks, two and a half weeks, to get to the U.S., wherever you live. I'm sure if you're on the East Coast, you might get it quicker than me. I don't know. But I'm just telling you that it takes me about two weeks to get stuff in. So if you want to buy stuff for Christmas, it should be here, you know. The mail's going to get freakier and freakier the closer to Christmas that we get. All right, guys. Thanks for joining me. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and please hit the bell. That way you'll know when my next video comes out. Stay safe. Stay healthy. We'll see you next time. God bless. Bye-bye. Keep stitching and diamond painting.